everybody. My name is Jack Quinn. Welcome back to the channel. We drove in to Disney today. We obviously aren't going to the parks right now because it is currently 8.46 at night. We drove all through the uh, afternoon. Pretty much left right after I got home from school and drove from Vegas to Cali. We are in our hotel room. And this is the view that we have from our room. It's a park, somewhat of a park view. It's nice. Uh, tomorrow is gonna be our first day in the park. We're only here for the weekend, so it's only a couple days long. But we'll be doing a lot of stuff. Um, I was here a few, I was here last year, or earlier this year, can't remember exactly. But, um, but yeah, so. Not much right now. Tomorrow is going to be rope drop to shut down, so it'll be fun. So again, this is our little view from our hotel room. You can see the, the Incredicoaster, the Fun Wheel, the Swings, and Paradise Pier, and Pixar Pier. It's a decent view. And then there's the little pool area. Here it's paradise. All right. First day of the actual park. It's gonna be a long day. Is that caffeine flavored or a caffeine or regular? Let's see. Do you like the strawberry water? This is our room in the morning. It doesn't look like You can see the parking. You can see the cast members walking down. You want any? Well, but cast members are yeah, walking probably. down there, be a bad idea. going into the park to work, uh, as it is. 7.06. Start of the day. Let's go. Alright, so we're through the security checkpoint. Now we're making our way to the Disneyland Park uh, for rope drop. Craziness begins already. Alright, we are officially in the park, We're walking down Main Street now. The park is now officially open, so rides are open. We got in the line a little bit late because it took us a while to get through the security checkpoint. And then it took us a little bit longer to get through ticketing. Uh, but we're in, and uh, you can see there's some Halloween stuff up in like, some of the windows of the stores. But, uh, it's gonna be a long day. It's gonna be fun. So, I guess we did make it for Road Drop because we're stuck here at the like, end of Main Street waiting to get into the Frontier Land yeah, for my, Star Wars. My day, so it's 8 to 9. So you go through the My Day selections, right? Mm -hmm. And then now you should be able to. I had to go through and do like edit selections and add for today. And then I I had the room key in my wallet, so I had to go and show it. But uh, we've got, we are now checked in. We're going in Tomorrowland for the early park entry. We can bust out Astro Blasters, Star Tours, and Space Mountain. Hopefully we can. Uh, and then. Nah. And, uh, Entering the land of tomorrow. But yeah, Disney continues to be confusing. Because you can't go in through Adventureland and Frontierland, but you can get into Fantasyland tomorrow if you're a Disney hotel guest for the early park hours. It's dumb, it's weird, but hey, we're in the park and we're gonna hit rides. I'm not complaining. Space Mountain first ride of the day. We'll be showing these pictures to your kids someday. Yeah. But uh, we just got off of Space Mountain. Way better than Disney World. It's smoother, it's faster, and it's two seated. More room. But it's, it's really good. Now we're in Fantasyland. We're trying to book it towards Galaxy's Edge to get on Rise of the Resistance before the rush of park opening because it's two minutes away. <laughs> 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 
The park is open. Officially, it's 8 o'clock. Still stuck in line trying to get to the famous, or frontier line. And it's moving. We're moving. Yay. Rope is dropped. Let's go then. So we rushed over to Galaxy's Edge only to realize that Rise of the Resistance is down at Rope Drop. So we're now on the standby line for smugglers, and then we're gonna come back and redeem our lightning lane later. Damaging the Falcon. Is... What do we have? Oh. Strength 
I think you were supposed to hit the orange button that would light that would light it up. Yeah, I didn't see that. There's a, there's like orange buttons that were by the screen that were lighted up. Oh, light up. The orange ones by the screen, not the missile button? No, I don't think so. Yeah, there's a big missile button. Well we tried to do the chewy mode. We tried to do chewy mode on Millennium. It didn't work. We'll try again next time. We have the lightning lane, so we're gonna go back on it. Because the line's probably a lot longer than five minutes. More than likely. Uh, but that was a ride through of Fountain. So, we're gonna go on it again. Chopper, chopper, chopper. We're back again. Alright, so I was on the left. We got two containers. Now after my modest profit, your gut minus what you owe me for damaging the falcon is hey, not bad. Details of Not bad. See if they notice. This group better not make any trouble. Troublemakers. <laughs> we advise you not to withhold information. Thank you, citizen. Over here. Have you pledged your support to the First Order? Have you sworn allegiance to the First Order? We are tracking a resistance spy. Clearly. Alright, so we did our second run through of Falcon. We are now in line in the lightning lane for Big Thunder Mountain. Ow, just smacked my new throttle. Yes. And. I'm trying to figure out which uh, lightning lane to do next. We already told you one time. Uh, we're gonna be doing Thunder Mountain next, and uh, we'll go from there. Three PL. Great one. I'm sure it'll be a smooth one. So we just we, we just did Star Tours and we were in line for Buzz Lightyear's Astro Blasters, but it just broke down and closed. So we're now emptying the line. Yeah, let's go fantasy. We're gonna go to fantasy land, I guess. Apparently, uh, but we got a lightning lane for. Indiana later. But yeah. Buzz light years and broken down. Yeah, I don't know if they're open. They've gotten more and more expensive. Just yeah. getting a quick bite in between rides. And we have quite the falls. This is named after our founder Albert. Albert Falls. But don't worry about that, we're gonna go over it later. Alrighty, welcome to the Nile River. This is the world's longest river. It goes on for Nile. And Nile. And Nile, wow, that is an African elephant. They are one of the rarest animals in the whole world. They're most commonly known for their big ears and their big tusks. Does anyone know how 
but we can tell that this is an African elephant. No, because of the, the big ears and the big tusks. I told you that like 10 seconds ago. You all have been waiting for, for the amazing, the stupendous, the ape, one of the world, the backside of water. And if you like that so much, this is the front side of rock. Oh, two, H. Oh, two, H. Alrighty, today we learned about two different elephants. Can anyone tell me what elephant this one is? No, it's a baby elephant. Y'all yeah, need to keep up. Alright, everybody, give yourselves a round of applause. You have all surrounded the world. Oh my goodness, I got you the best skincare ever. Alright, everybody, you're gonna be the best. Alright, so we just got off of Jungle Cruise, did a couple of things there, uh, updated it a little bit, added a couple of uh, Now we are on our way to Rise of the Resistance as it's open. Indiana Jones is still closed and we have a lightning lane for that, so we shall see. But, Buzz Lightyear is also open, so if Indiana Jones doesn't open, yeah, then we can we hit buzz, but yeah. so we've pretty much done everything. Yeah, uh, and we've got Haunted Mansion's closed. Matterhorn's closed. Because yeah. uh, yeah. they're refurbishing exactly. Matterhorn, and then they're adding the holiday overlays to Haunted Mansion, so... Uh, not until after not going to be riding Haunted time. Mansion. I love that ride, and not getting on that this time. <laughs> One can only hope. <laughs> Wasn't looking. <laughs> well, we're in line for Rise, but as we were walking, we saw R2D2. And, uh,. <laughs> I ate it. I was walking backwards videoing R2 and I, <laughs> I tripped and ate it. <laughs> Pretty much. I was just waiting to redeem it. So, yeah. And so our lightning lane for Indiana Jones has been changed to a multiple experience uh, because it's still down. So, we're just going to wait for... Uh, in line for a rise, while I slowly recover from a bruised ego and a bruised butt. Um, yeah. Yeah. 
I have been tasked with getting you to Makara. Red 2, Blue 5, keep tight now. Let's get ready to make that jump to light speed on my mark. Oh, okay. Well, then I think, huh? Black Leader, we're picking up an unusual signal. Are you spotting anything? Yeah, I see it. We'll check it out. BB-8, what do you got? There appear to be a number of small craft heading our way. Raise the shields. We have company. First order of TIE fighters. We are up. We are up. your children. Resources nor the courage to engage us. You want the rest? 
underestimate their conviction. Raise the shields! Shields? I see no evidence. Now! Turn the alarm! All types are down to their station! Sir, the prisoners have escaped! How brave! But ultimately hopeless. There's nowhere to run! So we just got off of Rise. Uh, we've got Splash Mountain coming up next. Um, but we're gonna go to the spot where I tripped and absolutely ate ground. Yeah, it's that one. Because <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> so that's where I took my, uh, my spill. I hit that and tripped and just went right over yeah, into you it. Down your left cheek, then your right cheek. <laughs> yeah, and you yeah. pretty much were landing like in that tree there. Yep, right there. There's the spot. <laughs> R2 is coming here. Oh well, <laughs> that happened. I'm fine. I'm, it's all right. These two, however. She was laughing so hard that no sound was coming out. Thankfully, the cast members actually were concerned about your welfare while we were busy laughing. Yeah. I was fine. And then this one was just laughing even before I fell. So. That was fun. You know. So it's what, splash next then? Splash then, whatever. Alright, easy enough.
Water from the front just shifted to the back and got my shoe. So we just got off the of Splash Mountain. We were put in the back this time, and like the entire yeah, back. A very heavy boat. <laughs> he is soaked yeah, to the front. Yeah, it sucks when you're in a heavy he was, boat. He was a kid in the front. Oh yeah. When you're in a heavy boat and you're at the front, yeah, that's not fun. <laughs> oh yeah, I learned that my yeah. eighth grade year when we did a main trip. This was the very shop that we bought, that a couple of my buddies from eighth grade on that trip bought socks from. It was this shop. Yeah, they bought replacement socks. <laughs> but, uh... Well, we gotta go back to the main store tonight afterwards okay. after closing, because so, it's, uh... Yeah. Yeah, All like, the weight was I, in the, the back. I was figured. stuck in front of... In front of, yeah, in front of both of them, but in, like, the final, like, three seats. <laughs> Yeah, we um, <laughs> I'm relatively dry. My shoes aren't. Um, I'm like squishing water out my shoes because of it. Uh, there's a guy in front of us in the front of the log. There's there's a lot of like big people in the like there's a couple of big people in front of us too. And. Uh, He's, he's getting stripped of socks. I can't look at rigging his socks. All of them are sitting there rigging their socks. That's that's them over there bringing their socks. Well, when I get the picture, you can upload the picture of how big the people were in the car. Oh yeah. There was there was a good thousand pounds at least. In yeah, that we were and bottoming out on the back. <laughs> the back of the boat was bottoming out, well, and like five hundred just between me and you. Yeah, between us, there's six hundred. Yeah, so roughly. It's like fifteen hundred pounds. So that big guy that should come to him was probably like two seats. Yeah, and he was like lifting himself up from the so seat after every like that's after every drop. Yeah. Easily that's, close to that was like easily 900 pounds in the four plus the over to the front, so I'd have 300 as well. At least 1200 pounds in that boat. Mm -hmm. The tunnels are meant to take that kind of weight. <laughs> then you add it. Do you want to use our one for uh, Deanna? Yeah, that's where we're going to go, yeah, in the way. I think we have to actually select them. Yeah. Okay, well, let's have a look. So, yeah, so that's that. And then, I'm like still like squishing water yeah, out of my shoes. It's not fun. This is not fun. I'm, I'm somewhat dry for the most part. But, um, yeah. So now we're going to go to Indiana. And then Buzz Lightyear after the fact. But we are... We're dry. It's kind of fiddly to start with. Once you hang it, it's just like the first passes. If you're, if you're smart with how you do it, you can get it going. Oh, jeez. So, she's dry. He's somewhat dry, except for... <laughs> just puff my legs, like, so... <laughs> and your rear end is, like... <laughs> it's just so... But it was, you were fine until that final drop. I don't know how to get there. <laughs> that could have been scary. <laughs> like, they literally, like, after we got off, they just sent the log straight in, because there was, like, water. Like, there's just... There was, like, three inches of water on the bottom of it. Yeah. So, and they were sitting there as soon as we got out. They were like, uh, yeah, no. "Not loading that one." <laughs> we'll wait. Well, I, I deliberately never put my feet down when I got out. I took them straight for the bed, straight to my, straight to the back of my seat, and sat stood on my seat. Yeah. So, that's our experience on Splash Mountain. I'm sad we can't go there. I want to go there. I want to ride. Let me ride it. <laughs> um, I think it broke down. Oh no, they moved. But there's no music.
Yeah. yeah, ball didn't go. We stopped. Hey, but time. we got on, so it's okay. That is true. We, I mean, we've been on it enough times. Yeah. So oh, yeah. know that please stop so I can get an intro exit, please. <laughs> I want an intro exit. One thing I've never heard of. There's an admit, neither have I. And I want one so bad. I almost got one on Epcot. Watch. I almost got one on Epcot, but it didn't work. They got it back, and the lights were on for a bit. Now, don't tell me that wasn't big fun. <laughs> Yeah, it's got issues. At least we're back in the station. <laughs> Not yet. Still got a bit yeah, to go. Just get my stuff. Yeah. Just get my stuff. Some flashes may play you in the panel like that. We could. No. We have just timed it just right to be the last one done. Yeah. It's totally trying to go. You can hear it. It's like... Yeah, I don't think it's working very well. You can hear it safely. It's yeah, it's trying. We might get a partial in show exit. Does this remind you of a flight that had this recently? What was we that? can see the terminal, why aren't we getting to it? Right. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. See the green, see? Very well. Yeah, they're, they're calling. They're calling it. Yay. They're not getting anybody on. Indiana Jones broke down again. Yeah. It, it, it definitely did. It definitely broke down. It's there's no question about it. Yeah. I'll do it. Come on. Come on. Boy, that could be fun. But uh, <laughs> yeah, we tried. We were sitting there for a good bit. There's a couple times where it stopped before I got the recording going. So close to an intro exit. So close to it breaking down and getting an exit. Uh, Is that Yeah. Because yeah. an intro exit is cool because it takes you, it gets you closer to some of the set pieces. Especially on some of the dark rides. Plus, you kind of go behind the scenes a little bit of the ride itself during an intro exit. So, you definitely get some cool moments while doing an intro exit. But did it get back going again? Yeah, and we were the test subjects for the first one. Oh, Superman. Yep. Superman at Six Flags Magic Mountain. I remember you telling me about that one. 
wiping it away because their blasters weren't working for like half the ride. Mine stopped working at the end of the ride, like the final final room or level. So we're not sort of counting that anymore. We're not counting it. So uh, we're gonna go to Nemo next, maybe. Don't quote me. And uh then we're gonna go do something. So, we may have just found a, a glitch. It's, it's, we're gonna have time to still before space. We could technically park off. I don't know if you use it Yeah, I don't think because it would happen here, I don't think we can use it over there. Just like the one thing we're going to get one for certain speeds, we can use it out of the park. Mm, that makes sense. But um, we used a lightning lane pass that we got from when Indiana Jones broke down for the first time. We used the lightning lane at Indiana Jones. It never went away and we used it again here and it's still on the app. We still got it. We still got it. So... Not yet. Yeah, but you don't want to tell them. Let me fix the glitch. So just to get back on it was kind of nice, kind of cool. It's nice to sit for a bit. Uh, so there's that. But now we're back we get in line over at, uh, for Space Mountain. Oh,
Now we're picking up some food, some corn dogs, and then we are going to go to California. I don't know. No? No? No. There's other. But uh, we're getting some corn dogs. Hi. I do. Uh, 8047. Perfect, thank you. Perfect timing. So then we're gonna go to California Adventure and ride in Credit Coaster. Alrighty, we just finished our corn dogs and we are now in DCA. Just walked through Buena Vista Street, just past uh, Grizzly River Run. Well, still walked past it. Yeah, and then we walked past the entryway to Avengers Campus. Now we are walking to Pixar Pier to go to the Incredicoaster. We saw some characters along the path. We saw Pluto, we saw Goofy. And Elsa. We've seen Elsa. We've seen Elsa from Frozen. Evan loves Elsa. Why? Why? Did you love Elsa? No, I don't. You did? No. Blonde hair? No. Yeah, no. European. I think the girl at uh, Pirates knew how to like cancel it out. The other people maybe didn't know how to cancel it out or something. What? Our passes, because we lost the passes down. That free. Oh, oh yeah, that experience. happened. That glitch? That happened, yeah. We went on to Pirates to use the pass. Yeah, after we, when we got off, it wasn't there no more. So. Hey, we used it for a few things. We used it for like three or four rides. It's great. So now we're going to Incredicoaster. And what's next after Incredicoaster? We'll find out after we use our pass for Incredicoaster, see where we go next. Fair enough. Is that for web slingers? Oh no, I know what it is. It's a stunt. It's a Spider Man stunt. Yeah, that happens right up there. Time for a little Spidey exercise. Okay, so we have now stepped foot into Avengers Campus. We're on our way to Mission Breakout now. We just got off the Incredicoaster. The Spider Man Stunt Show, or whatever is going on over by Web Slingers, just started as we were walking past, so missed it just, just as it started. But we got a ride to catch. I believe it's fun. You are now 
now standing in my private office. I know. Where I carefully scrutinize each and every beast that comes to me from different parts of the galaxy. And I to have to let you this guy. Hearing your insistent flattery in a constant loop was big motivation for me to escape. Ow! Ow! That was not part of the plan. Why? Of course I escaped. For those of you who have not been paying attention, the name's Rocket, one of the guardians of the galaxy. The smart one. Listen up. He's going to put you on a gantry lift for your tour. I'm going to sneak on top of your lift and take us all the way to the big old generator control room. I'm going to blast that thing and destroy all the control systems, which will open up every cage in this freak show and free my friends. Our buddy Mantis is in the getaway ship waiting for my signal, and then we'll be on our merry way. But this plan won't work unless you help. I don't have clearance. My hands don't scan. Yours do. If you raise your hands, I get the clearance, and the chaos begins. <laughs> it's a foolproof plan. Hold on, Rocky, you forgot something. Over there. Oh. What's going on? I'm gonna take this. Now move it! Alrighty, so we just finished uh, mission breakout. Going back to this land. And uh, we're coming in here to do the the Haunted Mansion, the art of Haunted Mansion. So that's something that I saw came out a few bit, uh, months ago. It's not in here. And uh, something that I've always wanted to do. The original concept of the Beating Heart Bride, which now became known as Constance Hatchaway. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, my marching band show from 2021. The original plans for Disneyland. So there's a lot of really cool stuff that was in the Haunted Mansion History of the Art or whatever that was there. And it was really cool. There was a, there was a guy that was uh, wiping the windows for the um, the original map and uh, model of Disneyland. It was really cool. It was like quizzing us on uh, Disney trivia and all that. It was really cool. Uh, but now we're here in line for Autopia for the Lightning Lane. It's getting scanned right now. And uh, gonna be driving. Here. Nothing like gas power cars in the future, huh? That's not so here for you. Hello, Dad. That's next on the agenda. Hooray! Mint julep and beignets. And passion. And a passion fruit mint julep. Best way to spend after Small World and riding the railroad. It's kind of bland. It is, yeah. But minty. Very minty. She looks pretty good. Alright, this sounds like it's gonna be like super sickly sweet. We'll try it. I didn't even, I barely got any cake there. Yeah, you gotta get down and get the. Yeah. The rum cake and the pineapple compote. That was really sweet. Oh yeah, all the desserts are just never fucking really sweet. Alright. Right. Sure, okay. Right. I'll take you. I don't know. It's like taking the whole thing. It's just break it down. I'll get it in there. Come on, it's fine. I've it's been trying. 
Okay, you are a mess. There. There we go. <laughs> Finally got it. Yeah. We're still in the Disney World game. Either. One of the Disney World over there. There were a few things that sank. Mm -hmm. They were huge. I know, I've had them. Yeah, you know what has a fresh one? You have some half to yeah. make a mess. I wasn't expecting it to come out. I figured it was in the bag, it'd be okay. No. Oh. You wanna go run and grab some napkins? Yeah. Did you see all the shit over the ground over there? Just don't inhale while you eat. Yeah. You don't want to choke on powdered sugar. So that would not be fun. Cheers. Yeah, it needs to be a real one, Joe. Can you get mint juleps at uh, Port Orleans in Disney World? I'll make them, maybe. I don't know. It's just one of those like iconic, like everybody knows about it, and you go and get that as a snack is your beignets and your mint juleps. There's powdered sugar everywhere. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have on my shorts, it's on the table. Mm -hmm. Just everywhere. All right, so we just got the alert that in 15 minutes, the electric light parade is going to start. Something that this was the main purpose of coming down here was for that parade. So we've got somewhat decent view, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I'm gonna try and get as much as I can. Um, oh. Can I help you? No. <laughs> what for me, you weirdo? <laughs> I'm trying to get as much as I can. Um, I won't get the whole parade. <laughs> I'll get as much as I can. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> And the spirit of Walt Disney's words that welcome the world. To all who come to this happy place, Disney proudly presents our spectacular festival pageant of nighttime magic and imagination. The hours of two sparkling lights and a rocko symbol that never be musical sounds. The main street, electrical parade.
comfortable spot. I'm just saying that we move spots to be get a better view. Somewhat.
Allah SWT I like how some of the costumes are retrofitted with lights
So we've got gumbo, we got blueberry, blueberry fritters. And right over there, the Fantasmic is taking place while we're eating. The electric light parade was really cool though. The actual like parade itself was really cool. I actually managed to get the entire parade for the most part. Thank you for Sorry. the light there. <laughs> no, that actually helped me a bit. Um, Why did that sound like Vader for a second? Like I do love Fantasmic, but I don't know how I'm in the mood to deal with that mess. What? Oh. I started freaking out because I couldn't find, I was like, wait, did I leave my bottle somewhere? But I was like, oh yeah, it's clipped to the bag. I'm just a mess today. Between tripping over just and- today? All right, just today? From tripping Any over and falling into the bush. Can and grab a knife so I can spread that butter? Yeah. So as I was saying, the, uh, the braid itself was really cool. It's definitely something that I'd want to experience again. It's really fun. And just the, um, just the floats in that were really cool. As the, it looks, I think the dragon's now out, the Maleficent dragon's now out of Fantasmic, so that's fun. So we're just gonna- Are you on the phone with Melissa right now? Huh? Are you on the phone with Melissa? No. Oh. Because she's texting. Oh. <laughs> with what? Just letting me know that, like, she appreciates that you told me how she felt. Makes sense. <laughs> yep. There's the Maleficent Dragon. Okay. I doubt her parents will allow Oh boy. What about that? There he is. But we're in line again for Rise of the Resistance. This is our second time on it today. It's pretty much quiet because Fantasmic ended, the parade ended, Fantasmic's probably going on again right now. So, it's fine. Like, I said, and then we got really, really lucky and we 
rides broke down during our return time. So they turned into like an 80 ride pass. And we renamed it for the good of our account. So we used it like five times for a Thank you, Nina. Black Leader, are you and your team ready? Affirmative. Engines are live. Red 2, Blue 5, report. Red 2, check. Blue 5, standing by. Engage the pulses and hold on, recruits. All ships, launch. As you heard from Ray, I have been tasked with getting you to Vakara. Red 2, Blue 5, keep it tight now. Let's get ready to make that jump to light speed on the clock. I'm going to get better here now. Black Leader, we're picking up an unusual signal. Are you spotting anything? Yeah, I see. Go we'll check it out. Give me a what do you got? There appear to be a number of small craft heading our way. Raise the shields. So it's kind of dark out here, there's not much lighting, I can't really do anything about it, but, but, one thing that is for sure is like, on Rise of the Resistance, there's a little bit of a hiccup with the Kylo Ren animatronic that comes in, where he does like the force stuff with the escape pods, not the escape pods, the transit, and it was down. And so they ran an alternate scene with Kylo in his TIE fighter. And sort of had that set as like a backup in case anything happened with, um, with the animatronic. So that was cool to see. It was just a slightly different version of the ride. But other than that, it's still a really fun and a really cool ride. And it's a lot of fun. Now we're going on to Smugglers, and then we have a lightning lane for Indiana Jones again. And then that'll probably bring us to the end. Alrighty, so we just got off of Falcon. We tried to do Chewy Mode. It didn't work. We couldn't get Chewy Mode activated this time. Looks like it, but what they did do, however, was make it to where our stats didn't show up. Like, our stats never showed up, so I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. Like, we got the money payout and that that we did for the mission, but that was it, there was nothing else. So, I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing, but it's still fun. Now we're heading across the park again to go to Indiana Jones for a second time. So a slight change of plan. We're not going to Indiana Jones. We're currently in line for Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. So we're in Fantasy Land. And then we're going to do a couple other stuff and uh, that should hopefully be the end of the day. And then tomorrow, that's going to be a separate video. We're going to be in Disney California Adventure all day tomorrow. It's kind of toasty in here. It's a little toasty. And we're done. See for yourself. Oh, Mr. Rabbit. Wait. Please. He went this way. Thank you. 
easiest place to find the rabbit? Hello, something? I'm not sure where I am. You will find it. Teacup now. <laughs> teacup. And do watch your children. Just we made it work. Pack pack is right here though, so this is gonna be fun. How fast are you gonna spin? I don't know. Here we go. We're spinning. <laughs> oh Jesus! <laughs> I have to hold him. <laughs> Jesus. Be careful, you're gonna drop your phone. I got it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we're spinning. We are very, we are really spinning. Yeah, that's why I look in the middle because then you don't get dizzy. <laughs> don't pull it. Alrighty. Well, we would be last ones out of this. 12.03, it is past park closing. We went road drop to park close today, day one. We got it done. Now we gotta go to sleep and get like, what, five hours of sleep, if not less. And uh, But uh, now it's time to get some sleep and uh, get ready for tomorrow at DCA. Alright, we're back in the hotel room. We're sore, but that's it for day one. We're sore, we're tired. We still got another day tomorrow. But, um, it's time for sleep. Uh, but anyway... Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like that, hit the subscribe button. Click the bell icon to be notified whenever I upload, which is every so often. <laughs> and as always, I will see you guys in the next episode or video. Peace.